So that, um, you know, they at least gain some more levels. Oh, and here is the enemy keeper. Well, <laughs> it seems that we have dug right, you know. Yeah, alright, so that's not gonna happen. Maybe he has reinforced all his freaking walls, and that if that's so, then we actually have to wait for our magicians to freaking... Door has been oh, wait, what's over here? Well, we can't really get over there, but... Yeah, we can kind of spy in his dungeon, but there's not much we can do about it, really. I mean, yeah, he has fortified everything, so we're kind of like stuck, <laughs> you know, against him. Yeah, look, see? <laughs> I mean, right now, usually I see the enemy keeper, you know, starting to mine away everything. Uh, but right now it's us doing that, so that's different. Thing is, though, he might have, you know, walled himself in. He didn't really think of uh, this gold, because uh, he can't reinforce that, so... Yeah, thing is, though, I kind of would love to breach him over here, you know? Breach him right into his dungeon. I like that. would like that a lot more. Yeah. Alright, magicians. Oh, damn it, really. Is it going that slow? Why are you so insanely bad at researching? It's the thing that you are supposed to like and be good at. Damn it. <laughs> oh, well, in the meantime, we are just making more fab. Still, we get more Miss Kinkies, really. But damn, man, I didn't knew you were so bad at uh, researching. Now then, you guys are hungry. What's wrong with the food in this uh, chickenry? I don't get it. I got a chickenry over here, magicians. Would you mind just go and feed over here? Really? I mean, what's wrong with the food here? <laughs> that's that's the one thing I'm wondering. I mean, they're all walking all the way over, you know, to the hatchery over there. For no apparent reason, really. Um, well, did we have any other creatures? Well, we did got something. And I guess it must have been a magician, or was it a Miss Kinky? Oh, we're good anyway. So, oh. oh we can actually dig somewhere over here. Maybe he has left some holes in his dungeon walls that we can breach through. Nope. Nope. I mean, <laughs> I mean where can we breach his dungeon? So far, though, I quite like it. How, you know, I mean, usually this happens to us and we're like, damn it, I mean, he's uh, making the push for us. You know, you feel that the pressure is rising and now we're doing that to him. And uh, <laughs> well, I'm pretty sure he's not liking it. Wow, what, where is this really? I mean, how is his dungeon layout so that we can actually dig <laughs> in between his rooms? It's pretty weird, I must admit. <laughs> Look at this, he has half-finished rooms everywhere. He has gold he can dig, he just doesn't do it. Alright. Odd. But, um, yeah, we will just uh, continue to dig like this. See if we can uh, breach him somewhere, and if not, we will just dig through the gold. You know. Yeah, I figured as much. <laughs> we we can just dig through the gold, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Look, oh keeper, you are so easy, so easy to deal with. Um, maybe it's actually not such a bad idea to also make this connection over here. And uh, I don't think it wouldn't be such a bad idea either to dig this. Oh crap, I needed to slap you first. Balls. Alright, we'll possess another one. You. Now that you are crazy fast and sped up, we'll do some digging ourselves here. Wow. <laughs> this gold is not in high resolution, by the way. <laughs> I now notice that. Yeah, there's a, I can, there's a few, you know, well, <laughs> rough pixels here and there, I can see. <laughs> I was, uh, is it an old game? Yeah, maybe, <laughs> could be. <laughs> so, yeah. The door has been manufactured. Good. Now, for the other keeper, well, actually, they have hooked up their domains and realms. So, the other keeper, we should be able to take him out as well, the moment we got the green keeper, really. So, 
Yeah, there's that. Um, oh, what I really would love is for this you know, to showcase this new spell. But um, we're not going to wait for that because that would be boring. So, imps, go and breach everything over here now. Yep, go and breach it. <laughs> Freaking breach it, all of you. Good. You have tunneled into a new area. We have. Yeah, I want you to claim the other side, please. And, uh, well, since we got a high-level horny now, this is going to be interesting. Look at that. Ooh. Your creatures are under no, they're not. Oh, no, they're not. <laughs> Look, we got Miss Kinkies. <laughs> Your minions are winning a battle. Yeah, wait, what? Miss Kinky? Why are you... Your minions are winning Why a are you not... Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> so you're on imp, you're on wow, <laughs> you're on imp mass murder frenzy here. Oh man, <laughs> look at that. These, wow, and these would make for excellent vampires, by the way. Excellent vampires, I say. Get all these corpses. You have claimed an enemy oh, but the blue keeper is now also meddling into my affairs. Ooh, but he has bile demons. We're gonna capture those. Uh, yeah, let's just try and claim some more. Oh, oh, oh no, oh no, you're not killing off any everything here. Very good. Yeah, I know that. <laughs> That's Miss Kinky, who single-handedly pretty much killed all the imps of uh, <laughs> the uh, Green Keeper. Look, look at that. Amazing. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna convert that bile demon and uh, torture him and all that. So yeah. Uh, you know what? What we're actually gonna do is um we're gonna lock out this area over here from our creatures. And unless the other keeper wants to come over here, then uh, we're gonna bring the fight to him. But I really wanna convert some of his creatures. So we'll have to see yeah, see, they won't even start to attack it, I think. <laughs> no, they're not. They're too stupid to even think of attacking us. <laughs> nice. Do you hear that? <laughs> Very nice. Now then, enemy bile demon. Go and get tortured. And how are you being tortured? Ooh, <laughs> they're poking in his ass. <laughs> the most sensitive spot, I think. Well, actually not, because he's also walking on it. A door has been manufactured. Yeah. You have claimed an enemy room. Pretty good. Yeah, look at that. The enemy keeper is even too stupid to batter down my door. So, I like that. Now then, um, Warney, how would you like it if uh, you would attack the... I said freaking attack the enemy hard, right? You've got stuff to do here. Do you get... Yeah, he gets the idea now. I mean, I really, you know, since last level, I really do not fear Horny anymore. Because uh, he has been lobotomized, so I'm pretty confident in using him as a regular creature. So, yeah, <laughs> that's good. Uh, Alright. You lot. Ooh, information. Oh, that's nice. Look, see, we can now see some of his dungeon because of uh, oh, uh, this bile demon has uh, told us. So that's pretty, pretty cool, right? Now, another cool thing is that these imps, you know, well, we can convert them, really, but they, they don't starve. So let's see if we can torture an imp and see what we get from that. Let's see how the torture goes, actually. Oh, they're hacking on him with his own pig. <laughs> enemy. Oh, how cruel. We're mining away an imp. <laughs> Pretty cool. Has been from the enemy. Oh, that goes... He's actually, these imps actually know quite a lot about the enemy dungeon. Well, that would make sense as well. We're gonna convert you, though. Look at that. From the wow. <laughs> I almost know everything about his dungeon now. Information has been tortured from the enemy. Good, can I also convert you now, please? I'd love an enemy Information imp. has been tortured from the enemy. Yeah, that's good, man. He knows a lot, you know? <laughs> Quite like that. I'm gonna keep healing him till he's ours. <laughs> I don't even know if you can convert enemy imps, to be honest. I never even tried torturing them. So, yeah, it's a bit of a first for me as well. 
but um, yeah, looking pretty good. An enemy has yeah, <laughs> he is ours now. <laughs> we got a free imp, and uh, look, <laughs> these are, it's quite a you know a big gain for us because that imp would have been pretty costly if we would have made it ourselves. So yeah, you are a stubborn bastard, though, Farty McFart. I want you for our cause, but <laughs> you're not coming. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Yeah, but all in all, going pretty well so far. Now, I yeah, we had one vamp, and they go scavenging on their own. I don't want that, so... Good. Alright, um, we have lots of crap over here, which we don't really need. So, oh, but did he have the newest spell? No, he did not have it. Otherwise, it would have shown up. If you claim a library with, um, you know, spells in there that you do not have, then you get those spells as well. But he didn't have any, well, destroy wall spell, so, yeah, we're not gonna bother. Uh, we're gonna sell off everything over here. But, um, yeah, it seems that the AI pretty soon broke itself, <laughs> so, yeah, pretty cakewalk level so far. Not been a challenge at all, <laughs> that for level 15 or 14 or whatever. So... Yeah, <laughs> quite a good and a nice difficulty scale up, right? <laughs> uh, but let's yeah, let's sell everything. Don't really want any rooms out here, or any half-built libraries, or chicken trees for that matter. I'm gonna sell everything. Come on now. I also quite like the sound. It's just the sound that uh, you have when you place a room, but then invert it. <laughs> whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> yeah, I think it's quite cool. So, untick that, and that, you know, if you didn't know any better, there wouldn't have been a dungeon over there. Good. So, oh, and uh, how's you doing? Wow, you are a stubborn bastard, really. Yeah, you are indeed very stubborn, but I do want you because we cannot get bile demons and maybe if we convert one then we will get them though Yeah, we are over our creature limit, so I don't think we'll ever find out if we could a get them Look at this the new spell now that also means that all our magicians have become pointless so uh, Not the level 8 one though. I mean, I'm gonna keep him but, um, the rest? <laughs> yeah, you're pretty much a goner. No, I, you don't get to feed. <laughs> you get to lie on the ground here after I've taken your life. <laughs> yeah, these magicians are a lot easier to slap to death than all these dogs and trolls were, really. I mean, I don't want these magicians because they take up, you know, they're, they're gonna battle against the vampires. And I want vampires more than I want the magicians. Nice! And now we got Farty McFarty. That's pretty good. Oh, <laughs> yeah, well, you should have hurried up, Imp. That's what you get for not hurrying up. So, yeah, lots of vampies. I like that. All right. Uh, we also got another one, but I'll drop you in the training room quickly. Hey, hold on. <laughs> you don't think you get to walk away from the graveyard now, do you, magician? Oh, no. That's not how it works over here in uh, evil dungeon keeper realm. Wow, there's so many corpses. <laughs> They're just lying on top of each other. Good. So, now we got the new spell. Let's... Uh, see it into action and uh, we're just gonna try and do the same thing you know and you know just assume that there is no uh, well direct access to his dungeon wow and actually I know his whole dungeon <laughs> look this is it I can see everything in here <laughs> look at that that's amazing you know what we can actually do what we could do is we could start scavenging with uh, our Biley McBiley we could actually do that. In a fact, I think that's quite a cool idea. See if we can get some more this way. I mean, he doesn't have anything to scavenge anyway. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna dig away over here. And, uh, well, I actually would love it if I could breach over here, right? Right at his heart. We'll make, like, a nice room over here. And then I'm gonna demonstrate this new spell. And we're gonna steal some of his creatures as well. 
<laughs> good, good. Now then, we need to be on uh, magician duty because, um, well, any new magician that comes over here <laughs> is gonna be murdered straight away. So, yeah, kind of don't really want you. And uh, in fact, I also don't want the other high level one because, uh, yeah, you're, you're also quite pointless. <laughs> so, bye. <laughs> I know I spent a lot of gold training you, but I'm not really bothered by that. Ah, oh, look at how much bigger he is as well. So muscular. <laughs> oh man. Um, good, good, good. So, imps. Yeah, I think I might want to help them along a little bit. So we'll do our trusted method of, um, you know, slapping and then doing the digging ourselves. Because this has worked pretty well for us so far. Yeah, I can't wait to showcase that new spell, man. It's amazing. Come on now. Look at the speed, man. <laughs> uh, what's it you call? Giona... Gionek? <laughs> wow. Well, these names are not for uh, human tongues to pronounce, it seems. <laughs> Damn, man. Yeah, that, that speed buff actually lasts for quite a while, because we're still sped up now, I think. Yeah, look at that. It was pretty, pretty fast. Pretty good. Um, you know what? We're also gonna... Well, should I leave imprisoning on? I mean, I got a vile demon. I don't really need anything else, really. I mean, they only got lizards and more magicians. Both of which I do not want, so... Yeah, I think I'm gonna put imprisoning off once we're gonna charge in here. But, um... Not there yet. I got this gold to mine away. And, uh... Good, good, good. Alright, so... Uh, how is the scavenging going, by the way? Do we have two bilies already? No, we don't. <laughs> Balls. Uh, anyway, we'll put this off. Yes. And, um, yeah, looking pretty good so far. Now then, we do not even have new magicians. Instead, we got two dogs. And you know what? We're gonna keep the dogs because... I don't... I mean, I can't be asked to just, you know, babysit the portal to not give me any more magicians. So... Your creatures are under attack. Who are they now? Where's that? Oh, haha. Yeah, you think you can get away with that, man, do you? That's not gonna happen. Oh no, <laughs> that's really not gonna happen. <laughs> you are up against level 9 Miss Kinkies and Vamps, so... <laughs> I don't know how you think this is gonna end, Keeper, but all of a sudden he just made the push, and I think it is because we are over here now, and then we're gonna try this out. Look at the, wow! Look at how expensive it is, though. <laughs> Bam! Gone! <laughs> look at that! All right, all right. Uh, how do you like this now? Yeah. Well, <laughs> we are also attacking him. <laughs> Look at this, Horny in there. Oh yeah, he doesn't even stand a chance. <laughs> Look, and Horny, instead of attacking the heart, he wants to murder off everybody over here. And look at how proficient he is at doing that. <laughs> yeah. I mean, look at that. He just one-shots everything here. Yeah. <laughs> what a show. What a show. Good. So, that was it, I guess. Yeah, bam, done. Now, this is gonna uh, give us a few more vamps, I think. Your I mean, it's a shame that we didn't got any more McFarties, but we got one, and that's good as well. Now, there the is one thing, though, and that is An that... Uh, I mean, what's over here, right? Now, let's spy a bit over here, because there could be secrets that I might want. Oh, w whoa. So, oh my god. There is useful stuff over here. Oh, actually, now we're what we are gonna do now is we are gonna put imprisoning back on again because um, that is useful. Those are goodly heroes of goodliness, and uh, I might want to take one of those to the next level. That is, if we can even find the uh, you know the secret to the next level, because I kind of forgot where it is in this level. So, but just to find out, I mean. I don't think it's over here, though. I, th I do think that it could be either over here or somewhere over here. But we're going to find out. We're going to see what's where. You have claimed so, come on. 
Oh crap, and now I might have... Yeah, I think I'm in the wrong imp. <laughs> ah well. Screw it, this one will do just as fine. Gap. <laughs> or cap. <laughs> oh, we got another fam. Wow. That's good, man. We got quite a big army now of fams, actually. So... I don't think we'll have any problems with all those m magicians and witches that I saw uh, in that room that we spied upon. This room over here. Yeah, I don't think we're going to have any issues dealing with you. Yeah, good. Alright, so seven vamps now. And a horny who is level 9. Wow, <laughs> level 9 horny. I mean, he can take on these goodly heroes but on his own, pretty much. Well, I don't really know that, but... I think so. Um, so yeah, you guys can walk over lava. I kind of need you to start exploring. Oh, okay. So there's nothing over there. Balls. All right. Um, well, in that case, go back to training. Because uh, wow, well, you've done the exploring. Is there anything over here? Let's just see that. But um, yeah, pretty cool new spell was this, right? I mean, this destroy wall. It does. Ah, secrets, secrets. But um, yeah, this destroy wall spell, as you saw, it is pretty powerful. <laughs> and another secret. See, I knew there were secrets. I just knew it. All right. Um, good. So what we're gonna do is, um, instead of just claiming onto the uh, area where the heroes are straight away, uh, we're gonna just dig away everything <laughs> over here. So that we can get those secrets. I mean, maybe there's even heroes in here guarding it as well, you know. Who knows, really, but... A door has been manufactured. Alright. We get another bridge out here. Yes, like that. Good. And then we should be all set to charge in that. Well, small fortress of goodly heroes. Which, I mean, I didn't even really knew that it would be here. It's a good thing I spy on this kind of stuff, really. Yeah, there's just... We just need to dig this away. Listen to the sound, really. Resurrect creature? <laughs> really? <laughs> Game? Really? I mean, I thought you'd know that I don't need those. But just listen to this. Doesn't that sound amazing? That sound of digging away the earth. Man, do I love it. It's really done well in this game. So, and what would be the other secret be? I'm kind of curious. Transfer creature. Look, that's the one that I wanted. Alright. Anyway, um, what we're going to do... Yeah, we got that on. So that's good. We're just going to bridge this whole area. You know, We're going to fill it up. I don't want... If we're going to have a battle over here... What I don't want is the corpses of the enemy heroes... To just fall into the lava. So, yeah, we're definitely not going to have that. Um, and you, you are supposed to be training, goddammit. I need all our vampires to train. And, uh, well, you know, let's just take a quick look before we start attacking anything. And yeah, we got high level Miss Kinkies. We got high level vamps and horny. So, all that we can't use really is, uh, is Bailey McBiley. Oh, and <laughs> I also got a pork. <laughs> totally forgot about you, but uh, you're gonna open up the door. Oh? Is that so? Oh, you might want to get some assistance then. Yeah, we are winning a battle. Wait. This was it. This was the battle. Uh, <laughs> wow. So that was quick. I thought they were all level 9 and all that, but they're not. They're all level 2s. <laughs> that was easy. Damn, that was easy. Oh, wait. That's actually a different room. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> uh, let's see over here. Yeah, you are the high level dudes. Alright, regardless, uh, what we need... Horny, take your... Wow, <laughs> take your cut. But damn, that's a lot. A lot. And a big cut. Uh, also, you guys, since you... I'm gonna scavenge if I don't put you in the right room. And, ooh, we even got a level 10 Miss Kinky right now, so that's even better. Yeah, alright. So, um... So it's only magicians, really, so I might actually be better off with, uh... Porky McPork. Uh, yeah, he got paid now, so that's good. 
All right, Porky McPork, it's your turn to open up the door again. And, um... Oh, no, don't. Actually, don't. Uh, we got all kinds of goodly heroes of goodliness now to torture and convert. So let's do that first, right? Yeah, let's heal all of you lot up before you turn into skeletons, because I don't want those. I want you guys to be part of our team roster, really. I mean, they're all thieves, so <laughs> they're no good, really. But I think it's cool to have... Uh, to have goodly heroes on our side, you know? We might wanna... No, I don't think we want to take a thief to the next level, really. But one of those... Wow, <laughs> that was quick. <laughs> Look at that. They, they only require, like, two seconds of torment. And they're just being tamped upon, really. <laughs> wow, that is really, 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 really quick. <laughs> You're so weak-minded. I mean, look at that. But then again, they oh, they got smacked in between the legs with those balls. Oh, wow. They got balls on the balls. <laughs> wow, that, that must have hurt, man. I mean, I'm getting itches even on my own balls from just seeing that. Wow, that must... Yeah, that was really... <laughs> suck balls. <laughs> oh, the word fun. Um, good. Now then, we got those goodly heroes. Time for the troll to, this time, for show, uh, better open the door. And we're gonna have our Miss Kinkies at hand over here. And Horny as well. Because Horny will do amazing over here. And then some Vampy McVamps. And right now, we should be all doing pretty... Well, <laughs> that was quick. <laughs> Your minions are winning a battle. Yeah, I uh, kind of noticed that myself as well, boys. <laughs> we have won that battle for sure. <laughs> Look, but those are level 8 magi magicians. Goodly magicians of goodliness. I really want those. I mean, they are really good. I think that they are better than the... Uh, well, our own magicians, you know, our, um, our wizards. Because... Um, they do not fight with vampires, while the, you know, our magicians do fight with vampires. Oh, and they even heal themselves. Well, that saves me from healing them. Good, good, good. Now, Horny, Horny is level 10 right now, so instead of having him just wandering around doing nothing, we will have him be in the temple. Otherwise, well, <laughs> he will become angry. Not that that makes any difference, as we know, but... It's better to keep him happy than have him be angry. So, good, like that. Now then, <laughs> look at their icon. Oh, they l so look like Professor Dumbledore from Harry Potter. <laughs> or whatever his name was. So, how will you get tortured? I'm pretty curious. Wow, <laughs> they turned him inside out. <laughs> wow, that's amazing. Look at that. <laughs> they really turned him. Or did they make him a frog? Yeah, they make him a frog. <laughs> a red frog. <laughs> a bullfrog. Oh, wow. <laughs> this game is so full of goofiness and secret puns and all that. I really like it, you know. I mean, these guys at Bullfrog had a great sense for humor, that's for sure. <laughs> they don't like it, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna we're gonna take one of those uh, magicians to the next level. I mean, now that we got them, really. I don't know if we have gems in the next level, so I'm not too confident about taking Horny with us, you know. Well, then again, I mean, we can also try and go for a Blitz with the Horny. I mean, he is level 10. Wow, <laughs> and they're also very weak-minded. They don't take a whole lot to convert. <laughs> Damn, well, <laughs> weak weaklings. <laughs> So weak. So pathetic. <laughs> Just listen, man. <laughs> All the screams. <laughs> I mean, the misses, you know. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, if you didn't know any better, then you could certainly hear that this is a torture room. Good. Now, you, lazy lot, uh, I do want you to start training over here. And I don't know why you guys are not training, but you're supposed to be training. Yeah, very good. Do that now. Train. Well, you're the most stubborn one, actually. 
He's like the most morally convinced of being a goodly hero. <laughs> well, if maybe if we turn him inside out like two or three more times <laughs> than not. I mean, yeah, it is really a frog. All right? I mean, he's not like turned inside out, <laughs> which I thought at first. Which would also be quite horrible, actually. <laughs> oh, look at this. I mean, she's hasted. <laughs> and then she also gets tortured at a faster pace. <laughs> Could I actually do that over here too? Can I haste you? Yeah. <laughs> now, when, now he's getting tortured at an insane rate. <laughs> yeah. An enemy has been Good. Alright. So, now that we got those. Beware, the Lord of the Land oh. <laughs> okay. Aha. Uh -huh. I didn't even knew that we could get the Lord of the Land, but. Uh, well, interesting. So we killed off two keepers, and now we got a Lord of the Land, huh? Well, I happen to have a Horny over here. See how you like him. I happen to have loads of vampire shizzles over here. See how you like those. And also, Miss Kinkies. Well. Yeah. <laughs> Game over for you. Oh, man. We got... So now we got a lot more of these of these heroes. Let's see if we can convert those as well, right? I mean, we're doing pretty well. And then we can have quite a lot of heroes to choose from uh, and who to convert and who not really. I mean, we could take a vampire, but the risk with vampires is that they can get scavenged by the other keepers and that's a real danger, you know, because if that happens then well, you're screwed. <laughs> I mean, if I take a level 10 Vampy make a vamp to the next level and he gets scavenged and we're up against him Then yeah, that's gonna be difficult. So But this I mean with this big roster of goodly heroes of goodliness to choose from we might even be able to level 10 freaking lord of the land <gasps> And look at this all these goodly heroes of goodliness I mean, these are giants. You know? Giants are also really, really strong. But, well, the Lord of the Land is even stronger, of course. We could indeed take the Lord of the Land. He is amazing. Wow. Alright, alright, alright. We're gonna torture you lot as well. And then we'll make a decision, really. I mean, <laughs> well, I think that we actually already completed the level. Oh. Really, they do not get any special torture style. They just go, they get ghost torturement, really, with just in a tent, <laughs> really. <laughs> but anyway, I mean, we've been playing this level for quite a while now, and um, it's about time that we start finishing this after I got these creatures, really. Wow. <laughs> they do, oh man, <laughs> the sounds are amazing. So yeah, that was the level pretty much. Quite liked it. It was quite uh, quite fun, quite different. Now then, we got two specials, or secrets. One's transfer creature, one's a resurrect creature. What of ours did die? Oh well, actually, a lot, because I made a lot of vampires myself. So yeah. An enemy has been converted oh, to oh that's course. quick. Yeah, I thought as much. That's not the Lord of the Land. I, I was hoping that it would have been the Lord of the Land, but it's not. The Super Knight. <laughs> oh, man. He's not liking it. I mean, he has a very high voice as well. <laughs> He's just a boy in a suit of armor. But um, I'm also quite curious what's up here. I mean, are there like more secrets over here? Could be. Or maybe not. Or over here, or is this just like some nice layout thing? Oh, they actually did have gems. The enemy keeper. I didn't even know that. I thought they did not have access to gems. But <laughs> they did have. They just never went for it, really. Well, that's their loss, and uh, uh, there are no gems over here, though. But I don't know why the enemy AI broke that easily. Look, but that went pretty, pretty well for us, I'd say. So we got all these giants now as well. So we'll have those train up too. And uh, well, the, <laughs> the enemy keeper didn't even have a training room. <laughs> Poor sod. <laughs> I mean, what was he thinking? Well, not much. <laughs> I mean, he couldn't even build up his own dungeon. But 
Good, so uh, the moment you get the Lord of the Land, I'm strongly thinking about taking him. Because he is supposed to be like the strongest creature of the enemy goodly heroes. And, um, well, you know, if we can have him in the next level. Because I don't know if we're up against good, goodly heroes ourselves or if we're up against, like, uh, well, you know, uh, enemy keepers. But regardless, he will be a good, strong melee foe. Right. Wait, your continued wickedness, uh, your continued success makes me sick. Thank you, your wickedness. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually a message from the uh, from the goodly lord of the land. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> I think that's pretty cool, actually. So, yeah, we're just gonna remove all of this because I don't need that to be over there. Now then, um, so we got the goodly lord of the land. Oh man, you're called <laughs> Cook or Chook or. Gook or whatever, but he, the only thing he had well against him is that he doesn't have any ranged attacks. That's the only thing that's like, um, meh. I could also take one of those magicians, you know, those uh, goodly hero magicians. I, mean, I don't know really what they take for payment. Uh, we can actually find out what they take for payment if I drop them in the treasury. They're dirt cheap. All right, that's good. I could take those, but they're really weak. Um, I could also take one of those giants. I don't know, are they expensive? They're even cheaper. But then again, I mean, why take a giant if I can take the Lord of the Land, really? And I don't see much point in taking anything else. We tried Miss Kinky, we tried Vamps. Well, we also tried a lot of the land, but I feel, I'm feeling pretty safe with him. So, yeah, we're gonna go for you. You, wh where are you, actually? Oh, you're heating up. All right, we'll have you do that first. Good, so you're healed up. You're gonna be with us now, Cook. You're gonna join us for the next level. And, uh, transfer creature. Wow, look at that creature roster that we got now. A knight, a level 10 super knight in shiny armor. Yeah, he is ours. And, uh, yeah, pretty good so far. I mean, look at that, 37 creatures. Well, we could only get 20, and that's all through torturing them. I think it was pretty cool, pretty good. I mean, it was quite a slow and long level, but in the end, I quite liked it. So, let's uh, see what the mentor has to say about what we did to Sleepy Burrow and uh, the way they greet each other with kindness and whatever else he was whining about. So, let's hear it. Herilyn's down. The people enjoyed each other's company so much that they'll be together forever now. We've thrown them all into a big pit and piled tons of rocks onto them. A fitting end, we trust you'll agree. <laughs> oh yes, especially if it was in my graveyard room because then all these happy forever together uh, people would become vampires for our cause. So yeah, pretty good. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, you know, pretty slow paced level and uh, an easy cakewalk as well. But this could have been a pretty difficult level if the enemy AI did not break, uh, you know, <laughs> for some reason. I mean, well, it had, didn't have anything to do with us, of course, but... Well, I think if they di didn't uh, broke, then they would have also had gems. And, um, well, we would have the advantage of the workshop, uh, you know... I don't really think how we could utilize that much other than make a gauntlet for him to run through to reach us. You know, and have that be completely filled up with boulder traps. And once that, you know, most of his creatures done had died in there, then we would come out and rush in. And of course we had horny, so yeah, there were I mean the way to finish that level was quite obvious, you know. But, um, well, <laughs> he didn't, so yeah, uh, it was uh, pretty easy, and um, I doubt the next level will be as easy, but um, we'll have to see. Anyway, I'm also quite curious to what the score is for our level, so uh, yeah, let's check that out. Wow, 1600 now, it's even higher than the previous one. And we did take our sweet time for it, and uh, we didn't face any opposition. Then again, we did convert a lot of uh, goodly heroes, and even uh, really high level ones. So that might count for something. Uh, 
At least I think. I'm not really sure, but... Anyway, it was me who achieved this mega score. And, um, yeah, with that, I'd say join me next time when we will play more Dungeon Keeper.